The great tiger is considered the king of the jungle. But is this title true for all individuals? In today's episode, I will bring you the tiger that has failed miserably at the hands of the gorilla. These are the times when the gorillas kill the tigers just to prove that the tiger is no longer the king of the jungle. A tiger is out hunting when suddenly he is met with a huge gorilla. Its massiveness attracts the eyes of the tiger, looking for food for itself and cubs. After observing, the tiger knows this is a difficult prey. Indeed, they are one of the big cats in the world, and despite their massive size, tigers have a very good camouflage ability. The jungle provides the ideal hunting place. They are formidable predators. The tiger hides. He watches the monkeys rest about. And suddenly, when the prey is caught off guard, he is ready to attack. The tiger appears calm, walking carefully, ready to strike and finish off his prey. With the speed and climbing skills, the monkey quickly escapes the potential threat. Just the moment when the tiger is ready to attack, the monkey jumps from another branch. But the branches grow weak and the tiger is unable to hold on. After he loses his balance, he quickly falls beneath himself. Hitting the ground sharply, the tiger must leave his prey. Two tigers are innocently playing. Just as the monkeys begin to move closer, they hang about on branches, bringing annoyance to the tigers. They slap their face and make them become angry. The monkeys do not stop. They rush down, teasing the tiger and making them jump chasing after the animal in the treetops. Eventually, the tigers must give up. The gorillas often gather in gangs to fight, raiding against each other's territory and leaving bloody corpses behind. They attack when they are threatened by human impact on their natural habitat. This comes from deforestation or arable land that forces the gorillas to live in a tighter environment. Thus, they clash with each other, forming strong oppositions. A mother is leading her cubs to a resting place. While investigating the situation, a group of baboons is gathering together ready to kidnap the jaguar cub. They plan, scouting out the jaguar, quickly moving in on their prey. The baboon now carries the jaguar up to the tree, avoiding detection of the mother. Fortunately for the baboon, she does not kill the leopard, but the mother is growing angry she finally discovers that the culprit has dropped her young. The leopard flees to the ground, looking for her young desperately. Below, she continues to get chased by the angered baboons. This is not a way to live. It is not until later that she finds a way to escape, returning to find her son. But when she comes back, she is too late. The young is lying cold and dead. A group of baboons are living together in the open field, happily and at ease. But when the lions approach, they are known as the lord of the jungle. All are afraid. 
the monkeys shout at each other, attempting to flee and avoid the lions. In the midst of the chaos, all animals are desperate to find shelter. One adult baboon is blatantly attacked by the lion. Now hunting the entire pack, seeing their fellows run, they are desperate to live. Angered by the violence, the monkeys together plot to kidnap the lion cub as revenge. It is not uncommon for baboons to steal babies. However, instead of killing them, they caress the lion cub as though it is his own. Noticing the absence of the child, the lion's blood boils. Quickly, she must climb the tree and find her young. She surrounds. The lion uses all of her might to climb up the tree. Not inherently good at climbing, but the strength and the sharp claws allows the lord of the grasslands to climb up and attack the monkeys. Playing together on the treetops, the lion threatens the monkey. The branches grow weak and the monkeys sit high. It is not long that the monkey tosses the dead lion cub to the ground the mother falling after her. It is a painful and pitiful moment for the Lion Kingdom. Baboons are among the oldest primates. They can grow up to 50 centimeters long and weigh only about 14 kilograms. The largest of baboons can reach a maximum of 40 kilograms. Baboons are considered one of the main enemies to the cheetahs. And in particular, baboons can become extremely aggressive. They are sworn enemies. As the fastest animal in the world, cheetahs are common in Africa and Iran. They can reach 95 kilometers an hour in just three seconds. After spotting a pack of baboons, the cheetah plans his attack. But it seems that they are sensitive, discovering the plan of the cheetah and quickly fleeing the grounds. In the wildlife, leopards and jaguars rarely hunt monkeys for food. But because this primate is agile and good at climbing, it is also intelligent. Catching them renders it extremely difficult. In times of food scarcity, leopards must sometimes climb up to the treetops, chasing after the monkeys. On a sunny day, that is exactly what happened. Quickly, the baboons encounter the fierce pursuit of the leopard. Using his claws, he climbs to the treetops. However, with the ultimate climbing instinct, the leopard does not hesitate to rush after the monkeys. And very soon, he is hanging about the treetops, trying to reach the weakest branch. This will cause his prey to give up. With one swift move, he is finally able to catch his prey. The adult antelope have caught in the middle of the siege against one cheetah and her cubs. They are hunting in the African savanna. With speed, cheetahs quickly catch the antelope that are trying to run away. Her two cubs immediately joining in. In one segment, the antelope seems to receive the death sentence, fatally being bitten on the neck. However, it can be seen that the cheetahs have strength and endurance, and in that moment, they are able to defeat their prey. Lost in battle, the cheetah has forgotten about its young children. 
those who have quickly fallen into the hands of the baboons, looking for their next victim. A jaguar is moving to the other side when he's come across a crocodile, laying ashore. He quickly approaches. He must stay low and attack from behind, wading through the shallow water. The South American jaguar is a very good killer of prey, able to chase as fast as an antelope while knocking down other powerful predators. When the jaguar finally manages to get out of the water, the crocodile is in danger. He did not have time to jump back in. The jaguar has grabbed his neck, pulling him down, and the crocodile fights back fiercely. He pulls him into the water. The fight between the two is dramatic. The jaguar might lose his life if he cannot control this prey. He has shown keen senses of hunting and ability. Immediately, he bites his head, going right for the jugular. He locks in, and the prey is now defeated. The effort is a filling lunch for this jaguar. Another encounter is destined for the lion. The target is the wild dogs. Lions rarely hunt wild dogs, but now, standing looking at them for a long time, he begins to plot his revenge. Here, he is finding a way to approach them. The dogs, still unaware of the existence of the lion, they calmly gaze at the sky, looking amongst the vast land. The lion has moved in. It has to go through a large swamp. Attempting to reach the wild dogs in a stealth manner, the lion creeps through. The mother and daughter lions have fell ambushed to a dozen wild dogs. While being attacked by the opponents, the lion must decide to open blood. Her cub needs a chance to escape. He hides in the ambush. The wild dogs gather to attack and the young cub is safe. The mother must fend off the hungry predators. The mother lion rushes in amidst the wild dogs, knocking the heads of a few stubborn ones. This gives them enough time to flee the scene. As for the mother, when she knows her cub is safe, she will wander into the middle of the battlefield, showing her bravery, the big boss of the jungle, charisma to overwhelm the bloodthirsty dogs. Once there is nothing else to do, the hungry dogs give up and leave the fight. Pangolins are about the size of a small domesticated animal. They have no weapons against large predators. When threatened, their only self-defense tactic is to curl up into a ball so hard that the scales cover their entire body. Then they wait for the frustrated predator to simply give up. Today in the forest, the lioness is roaming around looking for food. She's going forever without encountering any potential prey. The daring lion must attack the nearby pangolin. The lion's teeth are incredibly sharp, but today they are in fact not sharp enough to pierce a hole through the skin of the pangolin. The stacked scales are made up of creatine, a tough protein found in nails and in the horns of the rhinos. 
This armor can withstand the strongest bites, turning the pentagon into a difficult prey. In this case, the lion efforts seem to be futile. Trying to lick through the shell, the lioness once again tries, attacking the prey and grabbing at it with no use. When the pangolin curls up, the lion can't seem to find a place to put its teeth upon. It wrestles with it until late in the nighttime. The rain before the night has made the ground far too slippery. Possessing a rather small body compared to other big cats, cheetahs are recognized as the fastest animals in the world. Many have called them the speed kings. No other predator can compare to them in terms of speed. Cheetahs are animals with the highest success rate of hunting in the African world. Their numbers are up to 50% in total. While engrossed in foraging, the impalas have fallen ambushed to the cheetahs. The next victim. Suddenly they are attacked from behind. The African cheetah not only uses his speed and agility to hunt, but their intelligence to judge the escape route of different types of prey. Due to their relatively weak muscles, the bite force is not as strong as a lion or a leopard. So the cheetahs often have difficulties to finish off their prey. To panic, the impalas try to jump as high as possible, overtaking the leopard and finding an escape but his intentions are weak, and with a single fatal pounce, the leopard has caught the impala, knocking it to the ground and delivering a fatal blow. A young adult elephant was spotted in the bush. The lioness decided to attack her prey. The African prairie elephant is one of the largest animals on the land, a body mass up to 7,000 and a half kilograms, and a height over 4 meters. Outstanding physique. The African prairie elephant has almost no natural enemies, the most ferocious predator in the jungle. In our next day, the lion has jumped onto the elephant, spotting it waiting for the opportunity. When discovered by the wild buffalo wandering alone, the lions quickly approach. As soon as they approach their prey, they rush in from many directions. Despite the wild buffalo's frantic resistance. During the struggle, the lioness carelessly gets gobbled by her armpits causing it a not a light injury. The battle for survival continues, and the buffaloes call in more of their own. They must defend in a herd mentality. The enemy has become scared to death. The buffaloes are incredibly strong. Not only do they have a stocky body, but the animal is equipped with the strong curved horns that are unpredictable when in an aggressive nature. If provoked, they do not hesitate to fight dangerous animals like leopards and lions. When there is an entire herd, the lion is feared for his life. The mother lion is leading her cubs into the foraging lawn. After walking for a while, she has gotten lost in the territory of a large herd of wild buffaloes. Frightened and panicked, the mother lion has led her cubs to hide. Seeing this opportunity to take revenge, the buffalo begins to plot and kill against the cubs. It seems that the mother lion has read the minds. Now, she must move elsewhere. They have turned to chase away the large herd of wild buffaloes, chasing each other through the vast fields and the rocky mountains. 
After a while, the lioness has called to her pack. She needs to attack the buffalo herd. Joining the already several healthy male lions, this time they are more confident. They surround the old buffalo, isolate and attack. The males jump on the back, and the buffaloes have seen their members. They immediately call to their herd. The lions feel scared and worried for their cubs. At this point, the buffalo is attacked and the mother must run back to her young. Today's video is coming to an end and thank you for your attention. If you love videos about fighting animals, don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss the latest content. Thanks again and we'll see you in the next video.